What's up guys, this is GTFan712 back with a closer look at one of Ronnie Fogg's most anticipated releases of 2014, the Mint Leaf Gel Light 5. Drawing from Ronnie Fogg's Mint Leaf Gel Light 3, this release transfers the coveted mint colorway onto the recently reissued Gel Light 5 model. The official colorway is listed as Mint Leaf and Mint Leaf, and it released alongside the Cove Gel Light 5 on April 5th, 2014 for a retail price of $160. Now let's get into the shoe. On the lateral side, you'll see that the Mint Leaf Gel Light 5 is identical to the Mint Leaf Gel Light 3. The upper is composed of Mint Nubuck overlays and Mint Mesh underlays. The Mint Nubuck Tiger Stripes are backed by White 3M, and you'll find Gel Light 5 branding debossed near the ankle. Lastly, the midsole is a very light gray. The medial side is symmetrical to the lateral side, although you are missing the debossed Gel Light 5 branding near the ankle. At the back of the shoe, the Mint Leaf Neoprene Sock Liner wraps around the ankle behind a strip of Mint Nubuck. Below, Mint Nubuck wraps around the heel and features Mint Embroidered Asics branding all atop a very light gray midsole. At the top of the shoe, you'll see the Mint Nubuck and Mesh Upper, leading to Mint and White Rope Laces, one of four lace options that also include Mint Flat Laces, Gray Flat Laces, and Mint and Dark Gray Rope Laces. The Mint Leaf Neoprene Sock Liner holds the foot in place over a dark gray insole with Mint Asics branding printed at the heel. The standard Gel Light 5 outsole uses dark gray rubber under the forefoot and the heel with light gray foam under the midfoot. And that will wrap up the review portion of this video. I'll give you guys some detailed shots of the shoes now, and then I'll lace them up, and we'll see how they look on feet. And that will wrap up this closer look at the Mint Leaf Asics Gel Light 5 by Ronnie Feig. Like the Cove colorway, the Mint Leaf colorway has no story behind it, but it transfers extremely well onto the Gel Light 5 model. With an unimpressive new buck on the upper and mesh replacing the perforated suede of the Coves, this shoe could certainly be better in material quality as well as in construction, as many pairs of mints had significant construction errors including misshapings and prominent glue stains. Nonetheless, this shoe is incredibly wearable, especially during the summer months, thanks to the Gel Light 5's lightweight and responsive cushioning. In the comments below, let me know your thoughts on the Mint Leaf Gel Light 5. Until next time, this has been GTFan712. Thanks for watching.